Schneider cards here. Today we've got five of these uh, pristine hockey surprise uh, bags here from Dollarama. I've been looking for these for a while and want to do a quick video on them. It's really cheap. See what they've uh, done with these because I've I haven't opened them on the channel, but I've opened quite a few of these um, before they were updated. Um, I picked out all the thick ones. There was probably 20 at the Dollarama that I went to. Thought I'll pick out five, 10 bucks, I guess 11 bucks because of tax. But got the thick ones. We're gonna see what we get. There's factory sealed packs. Mostly the thick ones I'm gonna assume have some kind of protection. So I did pick out one thin one somewhere. I'm gonna start with the thickest one in my opinion. You can also get memorabilia cards, which are cool. And factory sealed packs. I got my scissors here. All right, let's see what we get. Hey. Okay, empty pack here. So we get a uh, factory sealed pack. Uh, 9192 series one pro set. Got a superstar, one superstar card guaranteed, and a original six pack. So this, I, I think when I've gotten this, I've gotten this one before from these packs. So I'll do that one after these two. Just remove some stuff. To make it easier, I'm just gonna, might speed through some of this. There's a little packet there. Steve Chason, Rick Green, Darren Helm. And that was the original six or so franchise. Obviously the Red Wings. Cool. And one superstar guaranteed. Let's see what we get. So uh, definitely if you're getting into the hobby, recommend these just for fun way to collect base cards. Fun open with a your kid or something just not gonna get anything crazy it's obviously you might get some good protection which protection most likely will pay the two dollars if you're to sell it but got barkov got greg patron rick meager so i'm assuming barkov here is the uh superstar now let's go into this pro set pack. You're not gonna get anything good. I 100% guarantee that. I remember I've gotten a stadium club pack from here as well. Matt Sundin, Doug Gilmore. Gordy Howe. Interesting card there. There is, oh, Steve Yeiserman. There is thousand a million, my maybe maybe millions is a drag, but a ton of those made. So definitely no value in those. So that was likely the thickest one. And this one's definitely the thinnest one. Like I said, I picked out all the thick ones except one just to see. Okay, so we got some we got a top loader in this one. A four pack of top loaders. Not not bad. And then we got six trading cards and then a superstar pack once again. So it's looking like you get two of these like makeshift packs here that they just put some commons in, which is okay. I don't mind getting some cool commons. Especially if there's like some flames in there. And then you get like a uh, protection or a sealed pack. David Pasternak, Ryan Strom, Mark Tenorti. Pasternak, definitely the superstar on that 100%. Just got a big extension, almost 12 mil, 11 point like eight something. So this one's just six trading cards. 
Thomas Hurdle, John McIntyre, Vladimir Rzhitska, Igor Larionov, Zdeno Cigar. I don't know, I've never heard of him. Sylvie and Co and Dylan Cousins' second year card there. All right. They all have like the same thickness. So I'm just gonna start cruising. What do we got in this one? More top loaders. Single card snap holder. I don't use snap holders really, but I mean, maybe shipping it could be useful. So this one's probably the weakest so far. And then we got the same configuration as last time. I think they try and uh, they put all the uh, they put two good cards at the front and back, or two more modern day cards, and then just '90s cards: Gallagher, Eddie Olchek, Jared Spurgeon. Superstar pack here. Obviously, remember ten bucks. Like it's obviously not a lot. Not a lot of money. I could say definitely could have the same enjoyment level as uh, a blaster box. And this is, if you buy 15 of these, it's definitely probably same amount of fun. Probably more. Bogosian, Gordon Murphy. Oh, jeez. Gordon Murphy, Joe Pavelski. Joe Pavelski, probably the superstar there. Two left. Like, I've seen 1920 Series 1 uh, retail packs in here. I wouldn't mind one of those. So we got uh, another top loader. So now we got eight top loaders. Got six cards and then a hundred, a thousand point club. So I'm trying to figure that one out after these. Nothing crazy, as we all know. Tyler Johnson on the back. Sean Walker. Tyler Johnson. All right. Let's see if I can figure this out. Thousand point club. So I'm assuming one player is going to have a thousand points out of these cards. So let's see if I can point them out. Sergey Fedorov. I believe it's probably him, is it not? Brad Marsh, Kasperi Kapanen, Joel Eriksson. It's definitely Sergey Fedorov, 100%. All right, final pack here. We've got Original Six, Superstar, and then another Pro Set uh, footage cut out for a sec. So we'll do the Pro Set for this, this time. If you're still here, consider hitting the like and subscribe button if you enjoy this content. Try and do this week, every week, once a week, a new video. Not sure what next week's video will be, but Rick Tockett, Chris Chelios, Lou Robitaille, McGilney, Recky. What even is this? Rink Rat Fan Club, hottest discounts. 10 cents off. That is a steal of a deal. All right, toss him right there. We'll do a superstar first. No Flames base cards that I can remember, other than the Pro Set cards. But. Aho. What's this one? Leech, Brian Leech? Steve Leach. Why does it think of Brian Leach? It's not even how I spell it. That's a cool card. Pinnacle from the 90s. Cool design. And finally, original six. We got Detroit once again. Well, that's cool. Got a Yeiserman check checklist from... 
2000, 2001, Series 1. And a Zetterberg card there. And Jimmy Carson. Well, guys, uh, that was definitely fun for 10 bucks. You're not going to get your value back, but that's not what it's all about. It's about the fun aspect. Look at all these base cards we just got. All a whole whack of randomness. Which was pretty sweet. And not just this. We got a snap holder. We got eight top loaders here. So pretty good pretty good for ten bucks. Honestly, in my opinion, might be more fun than a thirty dollar blaster. So anyways guys, thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you next week. Peace.